So what are people going to face in terms of this transition? What obstacles and difficulties are they going to encounter? I guess on day one, if, they haven't, if they're coming at the Eurocodes from scratch, the first difficulty is just the volume of documentation. And it's not surprising that there's a lot of documents, you know, 10 standards and 58 parts. You know, the scope is broad. Uh, first difficulty is navigation, I think. The second difficulty is familiarizing themselves with the vocabulary um, and, and some of the changes. And then just getting used to uh, the technical differences and the difference in style and the difference in the expectation of designers. Th those are the challenges that people are going to face. I think one of the things that's important to recognize, though, is that there are many of those difficulties um, once you understand them, once you've learned a bit, once you've used the Eurocodes for a while. They, they tend to go away. 